Okay, next will be box two, part, it's going to be part two of box number two. If you guys are still here, I really appreciate it. Yeah, these cottons are $3 a piece. $3 a piece. That's a deal. $9 for two, four, six, 600 yards plus time, uh, 30 times three, so 600 and... 90 yeah 690 yards for nine dollars not bad not with cotton yarn this is beautiful it feels really good it feels it's nice it's got a little bit of a sheen and um i like the way it's wound doesn't have a hook size on it it's 100 grams 3.5 let's see universal yarn incorporated with the finest fibers uh, US 4 millimeter needle and a US 5 millimeter hook it's in there. Tiny letters. But anyways. Okay. So got this. Color name. Brindle. I love that color. I really do. A lot. I love that blanket I made out of this. Okay. Next. We're almost done. Got two, two more bags. This one and one more. But um, there were some colors I wanted that were sold out, too. So I got what was available. And you guys know I like gray. The green, I think they were sold out of green. But I did get some of the green I have hanging up over there earlier. But I don't know if I paid $3. But I love, look at the sheen. Isn't that pretty? I love it. And I got three of them. They're so pretty. I think I'm gonna order some bags. Lynette Charm Grammy has the ice bags, like ice yarn packs. And um, I'm thinking about getting them again for sure. Yep. And I got black. I've never, this, this is the first time I've ever bought Haint yarn in black. It's beautiful and it, this looks like it's a number four, a thin four. Isn't that beautiful? It smells like wool, but it's cotton. It's black, that's what it says. And I got, let's see how many I got. I think I probably only got three. Yeah, I got three. Eee, isn't that pretty? So pretty. It's not easy working with black, but I think black is a beautiful color, especially with a gray. And even a tan, a taupe, you know? So. That is my premier yarn haul, magical yarn haul. Oh my goodness. I don't know where I'm gonna put it all. Well, right now it's gonna stay in a pyramid right here next to me. And I'm gonna show you guys a picture of it. Just a second. Those bags stink. I'll get a Ziploc bag. So, all right. I hope you guys enjoyed my yarn haul. I may have to bust it up into two or three videos. I don't know. So, but anyways, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I love you all, and I will see you soon. Mwah! And don't forget, get your mammogram, okay? And I want to real quick mention, definitely, I want to mention a couple Etsy shops, okay? I have purchased from three different Etsy shops, and my favorite shop is... Um, 
Her name is, her shop is called Heart Shop. It's got to be, you know what? I don't think I have the right information. So I'm going to do that on my next video. Never mind. Let's scrap that. I mean, I love Loopy Crochet. Go check her channel out. She has hats, scarves, shawls, necklaces, earrings, stitch markers, whatever you can think you need in your yarn room. She's got it, you know. And then also... Let's see. Get your mammogram. I don't have my hat on. I apologize. I um, it's, I just got back from a birthday party and I've been dying to get in this box. I had to bring it in the house before I left for the party. It was killing me. But um, again, um, Thursday night, we'll be at the Crafty Floridians channel opening boggy blankets from all of my subscribers and a lot of content creators have been sending in blankets. Um, if you haven't heard about Boggy Creek, our community has gotten together, uh, well, three channels, me, She's Got Yarn, Crafty Floridian, Miss Billy, and then Charm Grammy, Lynette. We've gotten together because my mom needed a couple blankets from the women's club. They were doing uh, gift bags for children for this um, camp in Eustis, Florida, my mom asked if I'd make a couple blankets. Well, I asked Charm Grammy, I said, do you think we could make a couple blankets? She's like, so anyways, to make a long story short, Charm Grammy got uh, Billy the Crafty Floridian who has a very large platform. And these guys have jumped on board to help me co collect blankets for this camp for s very sick children. And if you are interested in jumping in, on this blanket drive, I'm going to leave a link to the camp so you can see exactly what this, this camp is funded by strictly fundraisers. They have ca cabins that these kids stay in. There's always a doctor on call there on site at the camp. So these kids can have fun and be around other children that have the same illnesses. And they go home with a, with like a gift bag and they're going to have a blanket from us. And so far we've collected approximately a little over 50 blankets, not counting what me, Billy, and Charm Grammy have made. We each have like four or five each. That also will be part of that. But um, yeah, if you wanna be a part of it, email me if you have any questions. I'll try to put what I can in the description down below, um, the size of the blankets, and you'll send it to me and my address will be down there. I'm in High Springs, Florida. So um, yeah. And what else? Yeah, I'll leave a link. And I guess that's about it right now. And also, um, yeah, I'll do another video to do a recap before Thursday night about the buggy blankets. But you can come to the live on Thursday night at 9 o'clock um, Eastern Standard Time. Uh, 9 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And then, I don't know what time that would be in California. Um, but anyways, yeah, and, you, and we'll do, you know, we'll do more and talk more about the blankets if you're not familiar and you want to be a part of it. Um, also, I want to mention Sherry Kay loves crochet. She lost her daughter and we have been doing fundraisers because she left behind small children and they need our help and we so far have raised ten thousand dollars and we want to double that and we're going to have an auction november 5th at the crafty floridian miss billy she is amazing she's so wonderful and she's everything every goal she's ever wanted to reach she's reached with the help of this community this big-hearted community so Hope to see you guys soon. I'm um, gonna leave it at that. I love you guys. Mwah. If you're seeing me now, God bless you. You've watched all my videos. I um, just want to thank everybody who stopped by, who commented. Um, thank any new subscribers that subscribed, all my returning subscribers. And I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow. I do have a finished object.
and I'm gonna try to do something else tonight. We'll see, it's 8.30. I have so much fun in my room, it's like time flies. I never have enough time to do anything. It does, it just seems like an hour, five hours take, is an hour. It's like, what, it's bedtime? <laughs> so anyways, love y'all.